Developing now at 6 o'clock, a rough arrest at the end of a police pursuit in Santa Ana. Did the officers go too far, or were they justified in their use of force? CBS 2 Orange County reporter Stacy Butler is live in Santa Ana with more of that video. Stacy. Rick and Pat, it all happened right here behind me in Roxana Cedillo's uh, front driveway. Now, what you're about to see is uh, part of that takedown that she shot on her cell phone video. What you don't see is the officer a number of times asking the suspect to put his hands behind his back, but he kept them on his head. Take a listen. Last night, just after 7, police say two documented gang members stole a truck and led police on a high speed chase, going at times up to 95 miles an hour the wrong way through Santa Ana neighborhoods. Now, when the suspect that you see on the ground uh, jumped out of the truck and ran, police say inside they found drugs and a replica gun. Both men were arrested. The neighbor who shot the cell phone video says she thinks that police went too far. I think that the officers just took it a little too far. Like, I understand that they have to use force, and, and I'm grateful that they're putting their lives for us and everything like that, but there was a, a, a chance where he was able to just put handcuffs on him. There was no need for him to take it to the point where he was beating him up. At this point, the officers are still on the job. An investigation into this is just beginning. A spokesperson for the police department says if the officers used excessive force and acted inappropriately, the police department will take appropriate action. That's the latest from Santa Ana. Back to you guys in the studio.